Hey everybody, uh, welcome to Good Day Farm. Here it is, uh, almost the last day of March. And remember, we are zone five. Uh, this is the first tree behind me that started budding for its leaves. Uh, it started a couple days ago. And then notice the pasture, uh, how bright and green that is. We've been getting a lot of uh, fresh growth on the grass uh, in our fields. Um, kind of a good thing for us. Uh, this is unusual for this time of year. Um, we're usually just going through our thaw right now and we didn't really have much of a frost to thaw out this year so uh, the grass is coming back quick and uh, with a vengeance. We're going to take a walk up to uh, the upper paddock up here um, see how it's doing. This is the uh, winter paddock uh, sacrifice pasture if you will it's where the horses stay through the winter and so when the ground thaws or when we have rains or whatever it gets tore up pretty bad and rather than have them all over the property doing this we can find them this one area but notice grass is coming in here that's a good sign um, it does grow back every year this is usually one of the last areas to come back because of how bad it gets uh, trampled down from the horses and then um, this point up here, I think it's showing up in the camera pretty well. See how green it is up there? Cindy had uh, put some overseed on that last fall in hopes to uh, help, help it come back a little better this spring. And so what we're gonna do this weekend, um, now that things are starting to grow, we'll throw a temporary fence probably about here from from those clump of trees straight across this paddock uh, either in front of that dead well it's not really dead that broken tree there uh, it still blooms every year gets leaves but anyhow uh, we'll either go right in front of it between these two or maybe we'll go right behind it by that barrel but anyhow and we'll confine them to this upper area and uh, let this back top portion um, really come in where Cindy seeded it and uh, I don't know if you can see that little gap in the trees there. That's a fence. That's a separate pasture on the other side there. It's coming in real good too. So all our paddocks, pastures, whatever you want to call them, are coming back real good. Grass, you won't be able to tell on the camera here, but not tall enough to actually let them graze on yet. And that's the key. We don't want to turn them out too soon simply because, you know, it can kind of stunt the growth. Anyhow. Just thought I'd share that with you guys. Kind of unusual for us. Look how green those pastures are getting over there. Um, the, the very far one is, is kind of the one we run them in all summer. So uh, it's getting some good growth. Uh, anyhow, so like I said, I just want to share that with you guys. Unusual for us for this time of year. Um, but we'll take it. Everybody say hi to Cleo. That's the farm cat. She uh, does a pretty good job keeping the mice under control around here. Doesn't bother the chickens too much. And uh, the only problem we have with her, sorry, getting dizzy, huh? Uh, she does seem to go after the wild rabbits a lot, which we don't like because we like seeing the rabbits around the farm, but um, not sure how to break her of that. But boy, she does catch the mice. She's good in the barn. Anyhow, you guys have a good day. And remember, it's always a good day on the farm. Thanks a lot now. Bye.